Hey everyone, welcome back to another amazing episode of Design News, where I showcase the best trends, news, and much more of the past week. So without further ado, let's just get started with this video. I'll be hosting a free UX and UI demo class this Sunday. So make sure you sign up for that. It, it is free to sign up and the link is in the description. Now, the first news is very interesting. There is a Photoshop alternative which claims to create some artificial intelligence photo edits and artificial intelligence helps it helps it convert just basic photos into masterpieces in just a few minutes i'll probably put some examples in the background so you get some reference as to what this tool can do it has some very unique features like atmosphere detection so it can detect things like depth and other things so that you can add things like clouds smoke and a lot of other cool effects into your photos how cool and interesting does that sound it is not released yet but it is coming soon and i'm super super excited for it now we all require feedback as designers markup is a new tool which allows you to share your websites or your design files and get feedback in return this is like a central place rather than sharing your adobe xd link or your figma link it's always easier for people to understand such common tools and markup really helps you solve that issue the interesting part is you can basically use any link so if it is a website link you can share that link and then that link is generated into a commentable prototype where people can comment where people can put their feedback and stuff like that so i really like that feature and the best part is you can actually get this for free talk about free stuff the people at shapefest are giving you 3000 plus hand gestures all for free they match up with a lot of those premium illustrations that you can find on the internet which charge you 20, 30, 40 dollars. This is zero dollars. Completely free. Now my friends at Icons8 have taken out a new tool. I've spoken about this before. It's like the Sketch but for Windows. With this you can install Sketch plugins, you can run Sketch files, you can save as Sketch files and also you can, you can upload to Sketch Cloud. So if you have a Sketchcloud account or if your team has a Sketchcloud account, you can always upload there with this tool. Also, it has a lot of cool new graphic design features, things like cutting people out of their background, free illustrations and font libraries and much, much more. It's, it's a plethora of tools inside one tool. So I suggest for any Windows user out there, this is a must try software. It is free to download and free to try. Okay, now coming to the crusk of the matter, the title of this video. The title basically says, learn UX design for free. And this is true. They have taken out a new library, a new library of lessons, articles, and much more, where you can learn each concept of UX design different problems in the company or in the product and a lot of uh, different case studies that you can learn through. It's called artificial augmentation. The system basically has been taught a lot of UX principles and it studies all these case studies, applications and websites to tell you why something is done, how it is connected to user experience design or product design and how you can use it in your own designs as well. I think that is crazy and almost mind blowing how an artificial intelligence software or artificial augmentation software can achieve something as useful and as valuable as this. Again, this doesn't take away from actual real life education, but this is this can be used to upgrade your level of UX. Also, did you guys know Adobe Max is tomorrow? So whatever date this video was uploaded, the next day is going to be Adobe Max, the largest design event in the world. And this time it is free of cost to attend virtually. Make sure you sign up for it. I'll have a link in the description. I'll be hosting a special watch party where we will be watching the design event together, discussing a lot of other things also. And I'll be doing that on my Discord. So I'll have a link to join my Discord for free down in the description. I hope you liked this episode of Design News. If you did, then hit the like button. Also, make sure you subscribe to the channel. We're so close to 40K and I want it to be 40K by the time this video is released. So make sure you make that happen. I will see you every Monday and Thursday, same time with a lot of good content. See you later, guys. God bless.